Hello everyone, welcome to my The Young and the Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and the Restless spoilers and updates. According to spoilers, Jack Abbott and Diane Jenkins Abbott will confront significant hurdles in their relationship. Despite their promises to stay together through thick and thin, it appears like their marriage will be put to the final test. The Young and the Restless Spoilers Jack Abbott's Potential Pill Problems and Nikki Newman Viewers are fully aware of Diane and Jack's friction over his job as Nikki Newman's AA sponsor, which has made Diane concerned about Jack's previous addiction difficulties. Diane's rage is certain to reach new heights now that Jack has slipped and crossed the line by combining medicines with booze, regardless of how well he intended. He hoped to force Nikki into rehab. But Diane is suspicious, despite Jack's attempts to dismiss the situation and restore his sobriety. It won't take long until Jack is demanding another hit, sending him down a perilous path and causing a gulf between himself and Diane. If Jack isn't careful, he could spiral even more out of control, endangering everything he values. I and R spoilers. Tucker McCall's engagement problems. Meanwhile, Tucker McCall is frustrated. He wants to place a ring on Audra Charles' finger, but she has been thwarting his marriage plans left and right. With Tucker's fiery temper and impulsive personality, it's hard to be surprised that Audra's frequent rejection drives him over the edge causing him to end up at the bar and meet Diane. Imagine if things between them came to a head just when Diane and Jack's marriage was on the rocks. Despite their typical disagreements, Tucker and Diane may find themselves bonding over their relationship problems at the pub. May their squabbles blossom into anything more. The Young and the Restless Spoilers From Drunken Romp to Sizzling Affair Tucker and Diane's alcohol-fueled commiseration may easily turn into a sloppy frolic followed by a hot encounter. Don't forget Tucker and Diane have a past together, so there's always a chance they'll renew their romance. Who knows what will happen next? Maybe Diane will find herself in Tucker's arms again, sparking a secret affair or a steamy one-night encounter that they'll do everything they can to keep hidden. Will Diane's rocky marriage lead her to seek passionate relief with Tucker? Could Tucker, overcome by his problems with Audra, Turn to Diane for comfort. The Young and the Restless Spoilers for Thursday, May 9, 2024, are here. Expect Jordan to try to strike a deal with Victor Newman. Coming up on The Young and the Restless, Diane Jenkins Abbott issues Jack Abbott an ultimatum. In addition, Phyllis Summers offers valuable advice to Summer Newman. According to Lee and our spoilers for Thursday, May 9, Jordan will remain incarcerated in Victor's home prison. Now there's a sink and a toilet. So, Jordan has no reason to drink the booze. Simply turn the faucet on and sip the tap water. In any event, Jordan has decided to consume alcohol and is either intoxicated or pretending to be. Remember, before Jordan took the alcohol, she questioned aloud if Victor had cameras. After getting drunk, Jordan continued to chat about spiders. Jordan should remember that it's drink, not acid. That's almost as entertaining as B and B's attempt to convert candy, mints, or whatever into a psychedelic. Jordan's intoxicated behavior appears to be a performance. Victor Newman's game. Jordan refuses to give up on Thursday, May 9, in her quest to escape her predicament. Jordan will endeavor to reach an agreement with Victor. But don't expect Victor to agree to anything with Jordan. In fact, we anticipate Victor engaging in some diabolical mind tricks with the enemy. Diane Jenkins Abbott's Ultimatum The Young and the Restless According to the previews for Thursday, May 9, Diane will make an ultimatum to Jack. Diane cannot believe Jack consumed alcohol and used medications to save Nikki Newman. Jack can say all he wants that he only did it to save Nikki but the truth is that he is still and will always be an addict. While Jack may not desire to reignite his addiction, we suspect he has already done so and is unaware of it. Diane's ultimatum may prevent Jack from having any more contact with Nikki. However, 
Jack keeps inquiring about Nikki's rehabilitation. With Diane and Victor wishing Jack and Nikki apart, we detect an enemy alliance forming. Why and R spoilers. Thursday, May 9, 2024. On Thursday's show, fans can also expect Phyllis to offer wise advice. Phyllis loves her children, regardless of what she has done. She makes such awful decisions because she loves them so deeply. While Summer had been skeptical of her mother's attempts at redemption, Phyllis does provide words of wisdom this time. The Young and the Restless Spoilers and Updates Kyle Abbott and Harrison Abbott will go to the park. It'll be a peaceful time after all the Jordan turmoil. And they might even run across Victoria Newman and Claire Grace, two of Harrison's favorite people. The Young and the Restless Spoilers A Sweet Meeting Harrison will hurry towards Claire ready to embrace her and engage in cheerful chat. Despite Summer Newman's objections to Claire's presence near Harrison, Kyle sees no danger in allowing them to spend time together. After all, it appears that this unplanned encounter is completely fortuitous, and it's a random occurrence rather than a planned rendezvous. And Victoria is also present, not just Claire. Kyle has no intention of forcing Harrison to leave Claire or urging him to completely ignore her. There is no reason to be unfriendly or turn this innocent encounter into yet another distressing episode, just because Summer has personal concerns with her cousin. Why and R spoilers. Kyle Abbott ignores Summer Newman's paranoia. Simply put, Kyle has decided to ignore Summer's neurotic suggestion to avoid Claire and instead allow Harrison to spend time with her. This decision may allow Kyle to see directly how ineffectively Claire interacts with children, particularly Harrison, given their shared experience with Jordan. Despite Summer's concerns that Claire will rekindle memories of Harrison's prior tragedy, Kyle sees Claire as a great role model for resilience. Kyle may become even more convinced of this after seeing Claire and Harrison together again, and he may let Harrison and Claire to spend as much time as they desire together. After all, it recently lost a nanny, and Kyle is definitely considering Claire for the position. He can see she's a natural with children. The young and the restless spoilers. Summer Newman discovers the truth and unleashes her wrath. However, Summer may discover Claire and Harrison's relationship throughout the summer, or Harrison may simply tell Mommy about his contact with Claire later. In any case, Summer will be upset with Kyle for allowing Claire and Harrison's covered visit. He will justify himself, stating that it was not planned and was actually beneficial to Harrison. Summer appears to be about to release her wrath during a confrontation with Victoria, who will back Claire as Jordan's victim and someone who is attempting to rebuild her life. Summer will be upset, and it does not appear like she will welcome Claire anytime soon. Claire is likely to face even greater blowback from Summer, and Summer may even attempt sole custody of Harrison due to Kyle's faith in Claire. Cost-benefit analysis Victor believes he has the upper hand when it comes to Jordan. He threw her a bottle of alcohol and instructed her to drink herself to death. But Jordan isn't so far gone that she doesn't realize Victor doesn't want a dead body on his hands. What will he do with it? How will he explain finding it in his basement when he swears he watched her wash away in a flood? Jordan still has a small amount of leverage, and she's ready to take full advantage of it when she offers her rival a great bargain that will benefit both of them. The Chosen Jack will do everything for Nikki. That is what is making Diane so angry. Jack jeopardized his sobriety, marriage, and life for the lady who has always preferred Victor over him and he did it in such a useless manner. Couldn't he have faked taking pills? No? Okay, just an idea. Jack wants Diane to move on from his small experience. She's having problems doing it, which is why she issues him an ultimatum that he should accept. Summer is concerned about Claire's safety when she is near Harrison, as is the case with her mother. She is fine with Phyllis being around the boy, however. Why Phyllis is a pillar of rationality. If she wasn't, would Summer be taking her mother's advice on how to deal with Claire, Kyle, and anybody else who dared to disagree with her? Phyllis always knows the most logical way to solve a situation. So what do you guys think about this update? 
Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.